All right, uh, let's try to prove the reduction formula for gamma function. Gamma of x plus 1 is equal to x times gamma of x. The definition of a gamma function is stated here. All right, so I'm going to start with uh, gamma of uh, x plus 1. Uh, by following the definition, uh, I'm going to replace x by x plus 1. So we're going to get the t to the x here. Uh, we're going to have an uh, integral from 0 to infinity. And the first guy is t to the x. And the second guy is e to the negative t. And then with respect to t. By applying integration by parts, I'm going to take the derivative of the first guy. We get uh, x times t to the x minus 1. I'm going to take the antiderivative of the second guy. We're going to get negative e to the negative t. All right, so the first term of the integration by parts would be uh, basically uv. It's going to be uh, x, t to the x times negative e to the negative t. So I'm going to put the negative sign in front. You have a t to the x on top. Uh, it has a negative power. I'm going to put e to the t on the bottom. And it goes from 0 to infinity. Minus integral of, right, we're going to multiply these two guys together. But uh, since there's a negative sign, I'm going to turn it into a positive sign here. And the x is a constant. I'm going to kick it out of the integral. So integral uh, goes from 0 to infinity. We have e to the negative t. That goes here. And then you have a t to the x minus 1 with respect to t. Right? So let's look at the first term here. Right? Uh, if you plug in t equals 0, it's going to be 0. So we already know that. And we might have to apply uh, L'Hopital's rule multiple times. You can see that, that as t approaches infinity, uh, uh, t to the x over e to the t is going to approach 0 as well. So this whole first term is going to be 0. Right? Then what we have is x times. This integral is exact definition of a gamma of x. So therefore, we're going to get x times gamma of x. Right? So therefore, uh, we have gamma of x plus 1 is equal to x times gamma of x. Right? That's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.